Eternal Isles. Welcome back, everybody. Slash, never mind. Slash, getting close to that finale. Of Ascension. Slash, we're going into this portal. Slash, the wiki's down. GG. So the wiki's hey, down man. right now, and um, we're going into the Iro Mine dimension. Uh, you can read them the quest. Oh, okay. Um, a deep epic voice. <clears throat> Iro, don't mind this. Go find a way to fight the boss. And uh, the wiki's down as of right now. And hopefully we will get lucky and find uh, what we need to find to spawn him. There we go. I have no fucking clue. But we have a backup if we can't find that thing because the wiki is down. It's not our fault. We have a recipe we can make and that recipe will allow us to get the silver coin, I think it's called. To spawn I in the see. boss. Where are you at? I went through the portal. Oh, mother humper nubber. That's why I'm not picking any items up. Well, I was standing next to you for like half that time, but and then I went into the portal. Okay. Okay, I'm in a wall. That's nice. <sighs> Fuck this. Okay, I don't see our portal. <laughs> what the hell? How come you spawned up there? Burp. There's, there's no portal here. What, what are we doing? I guess we are mining. It's Iro Mine after all. Oh, dang. Go up. I'm gonna go up. Yeah, that's what I'm doing already. Like, what, check your Y axis. Uh, it's 24. Yeah, we're pretty low. Just build up. Ooh, no, it's not what I want. Stop. Okay. <clears throat> so, this is easy. It's quick with this pickaxe. What's this called again? Skeletal Grounder. Skeletal Grounder. That's easy. Like, I have to quick slowly. Or I'll just mine the whole entire fucking planet. Right? Yeah, it's beautiful. Okay. I see a lot of enemies on the screen. Oh, no. oh yeah, there's definitely some up here. Oh yeah, it's grass. Oh god, yeah, I'm starting to mine it. Jesus, get this fucking. Mine. So where's our portal at? I don't know, I'm getting shot at already. There's... Wow, there's a house over oh, here. Oh god, this flying thing! God damn it, I hate these fucking. Flying. That one just took all my food away! He, he stole all my dang steak. Right there. Like, yeah, I see it now, but like, get that they shit quit before they're exploding, dudes. I they quick gold. pocket what's ever there. Yeah, their name is Silver Pocket. Their name is Quick Pocket, but whatever. Uh, there's a oh, building over here I want to check Ultron! out. Ultron! Uh, you'll get me inside. I don't want to be out here. Maybe this is the no. Hello, Ultron. Wait, was that like, fucking lightning? Oh god, this is an area where monsters spawn. They're Ooh. called the Enforcer. Enforcer, these guys might drop the coins. Oh god, I don't like that noise. There's two of them up here, and there is a trans. Iro crate. There's an Iro crate in the corner. Jeez, what is this two? Is down. Probably something's in, uh, in the. Well, remember, tree. there was a crate item, yeah. But these guys probably dropped something. I don't know, the wiki's down. Well, 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 let's grind them for a bit and see what happens. Why do I have deep in here? Okay. I toss them. Oh, that's what I was say. Where are they at? They're spawning outside right now. No, they're spawning in here. They're right behind you. You just, like, left them. No, there's some outside. They're making those noises. Unless it's that guy. Might have been that guy. No, oh my god, yeah, there's some out here. Hello, Voltron. Uh, there's something called an Iro Trap. Don't you pickpocket me. It's out, Enforcer. Oh my god. This grass makes you jump. Why? He's dumb. Oh my god. Stop making me jump. Oh my god. Get out of here, boy. Okay. Um, uh, so there is. Get, you kill the ones outside, I'll kill the ones inside. So automatons here. Mechamaton. Automatons? You are not going back to the haven, are we? Please don't. Mechamaton. Behind me. Fuck me. Oh, jeez, hey, three of them. Cool. Fuck me, bitch. Fucked up! <laughs> oh my god, they slow you, I hate this. Slowed by, like, everything. Hey, pals. So, how do you spawn something in the crates? Like, do you have to give it a certain amount of coins or something? To give it something. I don't remember what. Boom. Boom. Uh, Enforcer. Okay, they're not dropping anything, so I'm gonna leave it a B for right now, but I'm gonna oh, wait for this. Oh, ah. oh, God. Found a different building over here. It's probably the boss spawner. Uh, I'm gonna look pretty big. Oh, my God. It's fucking gigantic. This is a really cool block. What is this? I roll pool. Hmm. Yummy. Cog block. Oh my god, he took my sword. 
get out of here. Well, do we break into it or do we help like? Me. Oh, hey, your sword, I got it. Help me! Oh my god, he's taking everything. I can't fucking kill him. He has so much health. Take this! Take this! Fucking! Just fucking kill him for me. There we go. I don't have my sword, but your pickaxe just blew up. I think. No, I have it. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, let's fucking go in there. What the heck is making me bounce? Okay, iron glass slows you down. And the fucking Flowers. yeah. Uh, and then shovel. Unbreakable Iro brick. Yeah, you cannot build around it. that or just jump as soon as you hit a. Oh god, no, 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 no. Strip it, strip it, strip it, sword. Get away. No, wow, I'm like lagging like a motherfucker. Uh, right oh, was, that was terrible. Oh my god. Stop. No. Oh my god. Oh my. This. Okay, Where do so. we spawn it at? We're gonna trade this dude. Uh, hold up. Bam. Silver coin, okay. So we're gonna just TP to me. So that structure we did find was actually something, but uh, we just couldn't find the entrance. But luckily for us, I have this one here. Oh god, I left like a whole layer of these here still. Let's break these real fast. You can break these them? These cause frame rate right here. Jesus Christ. Any explosions? That's it, I'm jumping in. Mm -hmm. Screw this. I'm not going in until I break all these. I broke oh, well, four over know. here. Seems good enough. Alright. So here, I hope he spawned one here. It's probably a maze, I guess. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna go this That's way. That's why I'm already running through it. Bam. Let me... Exact same way. Oh. Dead end. Uh, this way. Dead end. This is leading somewhere. Came back. Oh. Dead end. Alright. This way. It's gotta lead somewhere. It's gotta. Has to, yeah. Oh, it's a tree. I don't know if you oh, no, it's in. Uh, okay, down here. Okay, oh, oh, yeah, here we go. This is a bigger area. Ooh. Noises. Okay, uh, Ed. down here. Yeah, this is leading somewhere. I think. Ah, here we go. Silverfoot altar. Oh my god, this is a really small area to fight him in. Okay. Uh, hold on. Let me eat real fast. Let me get these weapons closer. This too. Okay. Uh, uh you get it first. Yep. Hi, buddy. Oh, oh shit. shit! Your foot isn't. Yeah, his foot's pretty silver. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I'm gonna turn down the uh. fucking volume. Like, holy shit! Where's he at? About to haunt his rifle. I mean, it's called the Juggernaut. Pop. Oh shit! He went over here. Oh. By the way, this bitch gives me a fucking staff. Oh, I hit you. Dude, he's teleporting all over the damn place. He's not uh, teleporting, he's running. He's the Juggernaut. How is he so fucking fast? Juggernauts are supposed to be slow, though. Don't I want to get out of the way of my cannonballs. It's a contradiction. I need to eat. He's already almost dead, though, so we really should not care. Yeah, another one. Take on this other one while you fight him. Okay. Yeah, let's go, motherfucker. I got this howitzer. Oh, he can't even touch me with the howitzer. Oh, God, no, he actually got pretty close. Killed it. He dropped a gun. He dropped the hey. rifle. Hello, how are you doing, Mr. Silver Futo? Do you I'm just gonna to... spam. You do that. I'm gonna walk away because he's starting to attack me. Get back to official. Just let me let me take him from here. Yeah. He's dead. Yes, great blade. <laughs> you kidding me? Let me see it. Let me see how it looks. Right, oh my god! <laughs> Garbage it only does 16 damage. Chance to deal double damage. That's not bad. So 32 base damage. All right. So um, not not, not too not too shabby. Uh, okay. So let me just get screenshot real fast. I like that. I didn't know it. I like this. Okay. Uh, let's. Go back and get screenshots of all the we things later. Be right back. Holy Turn shit! Turn in this bitch. Nice job. Ooh. Oh, explore explore on solar gem. I didn't get my trophy back. Complete. Oops, I forgot. <laughs> we'll get that later. Whatever. I'm just gonna start breaking these down. Bro, oh, a banner. Give me this Esplocron. Ah, I got it. Lucky bastard. There's 27 in base attack damage. That's actually pretty good. That might be. I'll get a better uh, sword. Skill this fuck no, skill sword. Sword. Just like 30. Got a banner. Okay. Three left. Come on. Okay. Okay. Ah, I got another one. <laughs> I have it. 
collection. Dude, come on. Collection now, collection now. Oh, come on, I got one. <laughs> Thank the gods. No, you can have one. I know you want this other one. Dude. My god, you're a sarcastic bastard. Whatever. I got one. Uh, let's see what it does. Uh, my creates fault. an explosion on hit. Billy, Real my fucking you. missing shadow sword. Fucking nasty. Boom! <laughs> Let me actually move in this. Kaboom, motherfucker. I'm gonna chant this shit. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, uh, since I have no trophy to place just yet. Okay, so let's place the trophy. This might have been a shorter episode. Because I didn't want to record a lot of the exploring. Because there wasn't too much to explore. Especially since we are just getting bombarded over and over again. Uh, but let us add this trophy to the collection. Boom, silver foot. Two bosses left, I believe, from Eternal Isles slash Nevermind slash Advent of Ascension now. Uh, and I wonder what this last pedestal is for. I don't know. Maybe we'll find a use for it. Maybe there, maybe use will come by. But yeah, I want to show you guys some of the quest making process because I don't want this episode to be too short. I don't know why he has like eyes in the back of his and his ponytail. That's kind of scary. Man, magma cube vibes. All right, so. Let's look here. So, how I make quests, I go to quests, and never mind quests. Look at all the quests here. These are all the old quests and stuff. So, we just did Iroh, don't mind this. Uh, so, the problem with the next two dimensions is I want to do, I want to go to the, fuck, what dimension is that? It's not Brathos. I don't, let me look at the portals. Let me look at the portals. Uh, the next one we're going to fight is the Deep Lands things, but to fight the ones from the Deep Lands, we need the, uh, we need an item from the other portal, I think is Dustopia. But the thing is, I don't want to, I don't, the boss in Dustopia, I want to save for the last boss from Nevermind, that is. There's going to be a finale after that. But I want to save Dustopia for last, but we need the item from Dustopia to fight the one in the Deep Lands. So this is what I'm going for here. We're gonna we're gonna make a crafting recipe like we did with the deep lands portal, and uh, we're gonna. Oh, I didn't mean to eat that. We're gonna make it so we can craft the thing we need to spawn in uh, the boss in the deep lands, which is the boulder dash. Which uh, I think we gotta actually like trade somebody, trade a dude, just like how we traded the professor for the silver coin. Uh, we trade them the heavy boulder and something else. The heavy boulder and the dust we have to get from Dustopia. But, we don't want to do that since I want Dustopia to be the finale. So we're just going to make a uh, custom recipe. How you do that? It's fairly easy. Just go recipe and then do this. Fairly simple. But yeah, this is how I make quests. It's simple from what I from what I do. I'm not too into the custom NPCs like all the uh, more in-depth shit. Like you can actually give dialogue. So when I right click on him, you can actually like put things here for him to say. But I don't do that. Uh, it's too complicated, especially since I sometimes I have to set these up on the fly. Like right before we start an episode, I had to set this up. So we do add a new quest, and we do uh, what's the next one? We're going to Deep Lands, Deep Throat Lands. There you go. Uh, and then complete text. Nothing creative at all. Nice job, uh, Nate. There you go. And, uh, and then we quest log and go to deep, to the deep lands, and find a way to. Fight the boss! Exclamation point just for emphasis. Uh, reward. I like to give us a lot of XP for uh, reward just so we can repair our equipment. Like in this episode, I use a lot of the grounder. The grounder went from full uh, durability to almost quarter. And that's pretty, that's pretty crazy for this pickaxe being really good. Uh, so we're going to play ignore damage just because. And I had to go in game mode 1 to uh, give myself the statue. And also the items. I usually give us totems from that dimension. Uh, but sometimes I accidentally give us totems from another dimension. But I don't think it matters now since we have one dimension left. So I believe the dimension from Deep Lands is Daybreaker and maybe Terminator? I don't know. I'm not sure. But yeah. That's really it. How I do the quest. And then to uh, set them up. I don't know about this dialogue thing. See this thing. I don't know what I did to mess with it. But this King Bam Bam one. See like I usually make it so when we finish it quest it brings us to the next quest but I didn't in this case I didn't make another quest so what I had to do this thing is set up weirdly I don't know what I did to set it up uh, but you have to do something with dialogue so when you right click on him and pull this screen up he will give you the quest so if I go here and do dialogues dialogues uh, bam 
and then click on the the quest we just made what is it called what did we just make i already forget deep throat lands which i'm not going to click on it now uh hold on let me do something real fast okay so go to here let's go back to the quest uh what quest was it uh deep throat lands okay so now we do add a reward uh we want our trophy back which i can also make it so he doesn't give take our uh, take an item from us uh which i think it is here I take items you can set that to no and he won't take the trophy but I just do it that way just because that's how I've been doing it and here's the thing where you can set up the next quest uh, and I will do that so now if I go here to the dialogue thing and go to the King Bam 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 one because this one always seems to work and sometimes other ones don't I'm gonna set it for this bam so now when I talk to him new quest deep throat lands oh, I clicking on factions uh, and then we go here Bam, deep throw lands, and bam, there's a quest. Bam, bam, bam. Uh, so yeah, that's how I do the quest making system. Fairly basic. Maybe I'll step it up in the next season, because the next season is actually going to be pretty crazy. Uh, there's going to be a lot more gathering quests, I believe, even though pretty much all of these are gather quests. Uh, but I might set up some more, I guess, unique quests. Maybe some more side quests or something like that. Uh, depends on how this, how the season ends. If I'm feeling that, uh, this series is worth it to put that much effort into when it comes to making quests because we do put a good bit of effort like I couldn't if I didn't put an effort in this series why would I have even try to make this house by the way this house was based off a house I saw in Skyrim it does not look anything like it I mean besides this over this overhang here I don't want to be seen by those charges but yeah I'm gonna go set up these uh, next two quests and the finale quest <laughs> What is this? Hmm.